Hi everyone, it's Giselle here with a message for today. I want to share more about how to prepare your subconscious before you go to sleep so that you are in a state of receptivity and creation as you are sleeping. And I would also like to say that love songs have always been a great part of my life. They were my favourite type of songs growing up and they just make me feel so hopeful, so happy, so magical. And really, what made me believe in true love was these beautiful, beautiful, were these beautiful love songs. Um, and so I remember when I was growing up and I was really into writing music and um working with different musicians and bands and they would often say to me oh you know we don't really have the same taste in music they were very much into angsty you know very angst music <laughs> um music that had this so much anger and so much anxiety and, and, and depression and sadness. But that's the type of music that they really were into and motivated them. But I want to say to you, and no judgment, you know, whatever type of music you're into, but if you want to manifest true love into your life, this is the best way to go about it. Love songs, the more optimistic, the more cheesy quote unquote the more sugary the more you know almost sickly the better <laughs> and i don't think there's any love songs that are too cheesy in fact you should hear some of the love songs i write for my beloved they are just ah but you know what it needs to be that way because our subconscious picks up on what we listen to and if we want to create true love this is our image of true love. Love songs are the best way to do it. So I'll share with you my nighttime routine and what I've been doing lately. So before I go to bed, I'll look at a picture of us together and I will say to him, I expect only the best from you because you will only ever get the best from me. I love you. And that's everything. <laughs> I ask nothing from him because I know that he already has given me and will continue to give me everything. And then I listen to one of my favorite love songs and put myself into that high vibration of seeing us together, feeling us together and saying to myself, I am ready for true love. I am ready for true love. I am ready for true love. And it just makes your heart soar. I don't know if you can feel my energy through this video. I hope you can. But it feels so uplifted, so dreamy, so accepted, so loved, so desired, and so fulfilled. And... You know, I don't really like to listen to sad songs anymore. It, it kind of makes me turned off by them, just thinking, oh, this is not my energy anymore. So this is just a little tip, but I hope that this helps you. And I hope that you try this if you haven't been doing it already. Because it's the fastest and easiest way of programming your subconscious and getting yourself into that beautiful place, making your heart one with your dreams and your heart is the key to manifesting your dreams. So give it a try and see how you get on. I hope this has helped you. If you would like a reading from me, then please find my contact information in the link below. Thank you to my new beautiful clients for contacting me, finding me. Thank you to my existing clients, my loyal clients. I love you so very much. And thank you to everyone who's watching. I truly hope that this has helped you. 
Have a beautiful day. Namaste.